What's up, John? What's up, John? What's up, Christian? -y? What's going on this evening? Got my earpiece in. Aaron, how's it going? My phone just showed me pop up in line, so. A little bit of a delay between us. Master J, what's going on, everyone? What's going on this evening, guys? You guys have a good day? Anybody do anything crazy? Anything crazy? Oh, yeah. There's the thumbnail right there. Great minifigs. I think this Spider-Man might be the same as the first one that I built. I'm not uh, exactly sure, but the one we got last night was killer, so. It's been a good day, yeah. Yeah, it's been a good day for me, too. I'm glad you guys had a good day. Yeah, beautiful day outside. Work was not bad for some reason. That I own all sets with Ghost Rider in them. Holy cow. How many are there? What's up with the one with the white face? What's, which, tell, okay, you tell me, Glitch Bricks, what's the best one to get? What's the best, what's the best Ghost Rider minifig? You told me you were going to get that, Master J. That's good. I'm, I'm, you order it from online or did you get it from the store? I'm happy for you. You love it? Look at all these fire elements. Johnny Cage is the white face one. What is that from? Is that is that the best one, or which one's your favorite one? Because I know this one's from like a specific series of comics, correct? This one, I can't remember all of them, so I like X Men the most when it comes to comics. But. There's our set right there. All right, dude, let's uh, get going on some minifigs here. Looks like we're going to build all three. Just bam, bam, bam. So these are kind of like web elements that are the same as what Iron Man has. And it looks like it, you can fling it. So I'm not sure if it, he holds it, the minifig holds it, and you pull on this and bing, and it flings forward, or necessarily what, what's going on there, but I'll play around and work it out. Set is good. Ricky should get Iron Iron Man Hall of, Ar Hall of Armor or the Armory. I have the arm, uh, this Armory or the Hall of Armor. Why did you have a bad day? Why did you have a bad day, Aaron? I didn't even see that. I'm sorry. Um, she dumped you, you mean? You'll be all right. Don't even fight for her back. Sorry to hear that, though, but that's a... Uh, that does make for a little rough day. So I guess you're not I guess you're not building any more Lego. Any more Lego sets. Okay, we got the Spider Man. Let's check this out. Okay, so he's got his arm straight on here. I see. Okay, so that's how they work. So that's pretty cool. Yes, you can just fling these. <laughs> Holy cow, those fling far. I like those. Yeah, you'll just give it some time. That happens. It happens, Aaron. It, it does happen. So, so yeah, it, it does suck. But. Yeah, those will poke your eye out right there. I did not know that Ghost Rider's uh, face was 
all part of his head here the flame and everything it's all it's all one molded piece right there isn't that cool Yeah, she was a faker. Love you. Oh. Carnage. As I, I really can't express how excited I am to build this set right here. I mean, seriously, this is going to be... We're going to build this carnage head tomorrow. That'd be the first helmet. I mean, seriously, I'm so pumped. Yeah, life will go on, you know. Just the way it is sometimes. Yeah, it wasn't meant. See, you didn't waste any more time on it. You see what I'm saying? Because they use this. They really did some, made some great pieces with these little new kind of clip bricks that they have. They just have all kinds of different angles in which you can display things and clip, clip you know, these kind of, I'm not sure what these are called, but they're very useful. Yeah, so check this out. Oh, 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 oh. oh man, this is gonna be a great minifig right here. Holy cow. Carnage is sweet, man, I'm telling you. Yeah, you didn't waste any more time on it. See, it's keep them feet planted to the ground and head tall. Keep on walking. You got to keep walking. One day you got to make it to the top. I know that's not how the song actually goes. Look at that fig, guys. I mean, I'm kind of wondering... I was going to say, it seems like those are going to be real close to the, wow, to the ground. Oh, man, this thing is crazy. What the, watch out, Spider-Man. There, we'll just have him climbing. <laughs> I don't really know what else to do with him. He doesn't stand on his own. Video last week on another channel, and I heard that same clicking sound, just like we hear on your stream sometimes. I had to go and investigate because it was bugging me. What was it? Did he say what it was? Or she? I love that Lego logo on your wall. I appreciate it. It's pretty cool, huh? He does blend in there, doesn't he? Can't even see his. Is that better? NS Lego Master, how's it going? Welcome to the channel. I appreciate you being here this evening. Did you have a good day? What's going on with you? Better. Better with him right here. He's just like climbing up it. What brand am I? Yeah, the yeah, 920 HD, yeah. Yep, that's what we got. I was just chilling. That's good. That's a good way to spend the day. I'm hoping to be able to do that tomorrow. Work on some content, work around the city. Ooh, this is a cool color. I like that nougat color. It's a pretty good looking color, honestly. Okay, so this build is already starting off different than the Speed Champ set, which is cool. This is going to be a little bit different here. 
I'm fairly excited to kind of compare the two of them. This one obviously has some upgrades and some cool features like your Lego City. I appreciate it, NS. Thank you. Um, yeah, I will definitely be getting Looney Tate and Mini Fig Packs. Just started nine minutes ago. Um, let me go back. Lego stuff. You've been working on Lego stuff today? What have you been working on? Sorry for joining late. How much did I miss? Oh, nothing. We just started right here, and we built the Mini Figs. Ghost Rider? That headpiece is a mold. It all comes together, which is crazy cool. And then uh, Spider-Man is exactly the same as the one, the one that we got in the Spider-Man versus Sandman set, that $9.99 set. I feel a little bit better now I'm watching your live stream. Yeah, you can't stress it, man. You can't let things get you down. You know, it's just, it's not good because once you go down and you enter a place that's down and you try and uh, make any other decisions in your life, they're going to be, they're going to have that negative filter on them. It just doesn't work out. So, oh, you have, do you have content on your channel? Like, check out your Lego City as well. A focus motor moving during autofocus. Ah, you guys see it when I move around? Hold on. I'll try and be real still. That way we don't get much autofocus. <laughs> With that model, no, I need a different model. I like models. They're pretty. What got you into Lego? Just wondering. I was into Lego when I was a kid, right? So my brother and I used to kind of have a little setup. I kind of built this little custom Lego city back when I was a kid. And I don't know. It's one of those things that just kind of like comes after you a little bit. Just kind of follows you around sometimes. And uh, yeah, I saw some of the youtubers who are doing it nowadays and yeah he's right here you see him he's climbing his little tentacles they hang down too far he doesn't stand and i saw some of these lego youtubers i spend a lot of time on youtube and i saw some of these lego youtubers and i was like dude that's crazy like these guys go hard you know what i mean to fix it either have to use an external mic or turn off autofocus um i'll probably be using an external mic sooner rather than later An external mic wouldn't be a bad gig, honestly. That's, you know, just wear it somewhere over here. I could probably um, throw some effects on it and it'd be a little bit better in terms of picking up dumb sounds, you know what I mean? Put a compressor through it or something. So I'm a little confused here. Seems like it's right, but then flip over here. Oh, I need these pieces, John. I'm telling you, I need one to pop up in gray. I will steal it from a set. I don't care. Uh, this is Spider-Man Noir right here. This is Spider-Man from the Great Depression era. Oh, that autofocus, it's going to happen. Sorry, he's so dark. It really is kind of hard for me to show you. Uh, you I mean, that's, I'm sorry, that's his tuxedo. He's wearing like a tux. It's like a leather jacket, really, is more or less what it is. The hat, apparently, I did some reading on him a little bit, and apparently, in the comics, originally started out with two revolvers, so. Nice, that sounds good. I have some... Let me go back. I'm sorry. You guys do chat a bunch nowadays. I appreciate that. Thank you. Um, yeah, I have some of the buildings that you have in your Lego city, but I have no modulars. Really? That's really cool. 
Yeah, right here. This is my shopping district right here. Bike shop, corner deli, bike shop, cafe, uh, townhouse pet shop, mock Lego store. Not really mock, just kind of a modularization. And what set did you get that Spider-Man? This Spider-Man Noir right here? Uh, that Venom, that Venom Meg. No problem, Aaron. Yeah, just chill. Just chill, man. Do something you want to do. I'm a lady and not afraid to slam a pizza, John. Duh, John. Got to go. I eat a lot. Take it easy, Aaron. Yep, take it easy, Aaron. I'll probably see you back here in a little bit. Um, let's see. Oh, yeah, don't forget to like the stream, guys. I appreciate that. I always forget to tell you that. Seems like this piece would stick out like a sore thumb. Okay, what's the set number for that Venom Mac? I might get that set. It's thirty dollars. How come every time that I type Lego, whether it's on my computer or my phone, I always press R instead of B? <laughs> like it up. Like it up. Oh, check this out. Okay, so this is what we have built here. So we have some studs on the side there, all the way down that side, all the way down that side. And this is what we have. Check this out. Kind of an interesting way to build, right? He said they need all those studs on the side, so they did a very, very good job of doing that. And then jumping right back into black, covering everything up. Cover that whole thing up right there. And then we throw all of our wheel wells on. Isn't that crazy? Except for oh, the, so the back sits higher. The wheels sit, sit higher on the back. This is going to be a real muscle car right here. It's on fire. Pizza is good food. Yeah. It's kind of hard to disagree with that. Venom Mac, you ready? Ready for the uh, set number? 76150. 76150. Venom Mac. Currently available. Comes with a, that that venom mech is fantastic. Oh, I break my back. There's my venom mech right there. Isn't that sick, man? I really cannot wait to get the venom head too. Like, dude, I, I don't know why I'm so excited about those heads. Like, I just have this weird collect like collector in me that's like, ah. Yep, 76150, yep. Yeah, sorry, you should have got it yesterday if you wanted it. If you're craving, it's not a big deal. I just. I have to go. Sorry. It's not a big deal. I'm going to check out your channel in a little bit. See what's going on in your city. It's not a big deal. I appreciate you stopping by. Had an all cheese pizza from Little Caesars the other week. One half inch thick layer of cheese. Yum. Bro, you should make a fight scene in your city between the Miles Mac and the Venom Mac. 100%. 100 percent. You know the scenes. You know how we do it around here. You know it's going down. What what am I doing wrong here?
just seems weird because it's going to have an open spot right there. I'm telling you, it's, it seems very strange to me. My mind and body were just like trying to build it the other way. Love that idea. Yeah, this week we've got a, um, yeah, it's kind of going to be like, you know, I kind of keep it themed with what's going on. So I have to hit the hospital a little bit. We're going to have some it's medical emergencies. Medical emergencies. These are for the headlights. These these uh, bricks actually are called like headlights, studs on the side stuff. Oh, I like toppings too. Pepperoni, bacon, mushrooms, and onions. Onions on a pizza is uh, no good. I used to work at Papa John's. I know it's not the best pizza in the world, but the best pizza that we ever made in there was mushrooms. It was mushrooms and pepperoni on top. Then you would cheese it. And then you put jalapenos and pineapple on top. You can add bacon inside right there with the uh, with the mushroom too if you wanted to, but um, I mean onions are cool when they're like concealed. I don't like a I don't really like to eat just an onion really. You ordered there today. Yeah, I mean, it's kind of not the best quality pizza, really. It's not bad if you just need to get by off a $10 pizza. But... Yeah, definitely not the uh, the high-class uh, pizza option. Got to say. I slapped plenty of dough around back in my day, you know what I mean? Just That's the, that's the hand motion. Grab it. You got to pull it down the arm. Flick it, pull it down the arm. Flick it, pull it down the arm, and kind of rotate it as you're going. Mm. Fling it, mm. catch it, boom, keep going. Mm. Fling it, catch it. Mm. Dude, I said light sauce, extra pepperoni, right? Let me guess, light pepperoni. Typical. I would have called them and been like, yo, I need a free pizza uh, next Thursday. I'll appreciate it. I would call them, actually. Because then next time I come over, we can get a free pizza. Pineapple is good too with ham or pepperoni. Yeah, ham's not bad on the pizza, really. I'm kind of a texture guy when it comes to certain things. You know, like if I'm eating a beef stew, no problem with an onion being in there. But if I'm eating, yeah, if, like if I'm eating spaghetti, why is there onion in there? Yeah, you're old, dude. I don't really know what to tell you. It's time to face facts. Face facts, you're old, dude. <laughs> never. Never. I will never take that back. Make me, make me, you can't make me. First pizza with pineapple and ham I had at Pizza Hut. Been hooked ever since. You know, when Pizza Hut does their pizza well, they make a good pizza. I got to say it. They can make a bad pizza as well, but when they do a pizza right, they make a good pizza. I really love Pizza Hut stuffed crust. Very, very good. I mean, that crust is so good. Oh, man. Love it. With the hot favorite seasoning on it, you know what I mean? Mmm. Find no adult time for you ever again. I get adult time right now. Every time's adult time for me. Pan pizza. Yep, my dad's a pan pizza kind of guy himself, so 
I do like a pan pizza. Okay, so check this out. So we have a, available two available studs right there. We also have studs right here. But we're just going to slide this in right here because we have this clip down here that we can clip into. And they're going to use that as the connector right there. What's everyone's favorite pizza place? Little Caesars is your favorite? Hmm. I mean, it would be somewhere really expensive, honestly, if I had to pick my real favorite. I like the sauce from a deep dish pizza. The sauce that they use in a deep dish pizza has kind of like that spice to it. You know what I mean? I know. Yeah, I knew John's age. I think he's exactly my dad's age. Well, both my parents' age right now. No. Yeah, mom's mom's one year younger right now. I really like the sauce from a, from a deep dish pizza. I just don't like it not being fully cooked all the way, maybe. But a deep dish pizza. Mm -hmm. It would have to be from an Italian restaurant. Where they do the uh, toppings under the cheese for sure. Or what is it? that you, I can't remember. The saw, I can't remember how they do it. I'm a pizza snob. You got to have the goods. It can't be some ratchet pizza for John. No. No, he's too good for that. I'm a pizza snob. Stop it, guys. I haven't eaten. Now I want some pizza, dude. Now I want some pizza. Should I put you down as my emergency contact in case they break my back? Yeah, I would like to know that. Yeah, I, that, that's something I would care to know. Bro, oh, that's not okay if they break your back. He says, I would like to know because I'm leaving you the moment you can't walk. I wouldn't leave you, but that sucks. Not really for me. I wouldn't leave you because you broke your back. What kind of man would I be, dude? You don't think very highly of me, huh? Don't worry, he will over time. We've had this discussion recently about you breaking your back and me leaving you. What's up, Big Block? Welcome, man. Long time to see. What's going on this evening? You doing all right? So they just make this very smooth. Lots of tile. So we had those cheese wedges down there, one by one, and some one by twos. Those on both sides. Clean that up real nice on that side there. Boom. Just eating some dinner. Everyone's eating dinner but me. What are you eating? And your literal words were, I don't think I'm okay to take care of someone. I don't even, that doesn't even make sense. Dude, I would not leave you because you had a mess. I would just cry. 
really, really hard sometimes. Brendan, welcome. How's it going? Welcome to the channel. Thanks for stopping by. I appreciate that. What are you doing this evening? I'm not eating while I build Lego. We're getting fingerprints all over this stuff. It's already bad enough when you got some of these dark colors. Back, everyone. I knew we'd see you again. What's going on, Aaron? Yeah, I didn't even grab a drink, honestly. I was messing around on TikTok. TikTok on the clock. Something about the DJ. ASMR when you hear things. That's so weird. No, I was talking to you. Christian is my girlfriend, so. Definitely interested in what you think about the wheels in this set. Grab a Calypso. Oh, I don't have a Calypso. It's been a few days. You already know. How I feel about the wheels because the back ones, the rear wheels are bigger. Is that what you mean? Let me put them on. Let me put them on and I'll let you know. They break for dinner in the middle of the live stream, huh? It doesn't bother you guys? Yeah, sometimes you got to do that. You know what I mean? The front wheels are terrible. Okay. No, I was talking to you, Brendan. What's going on this evening? I already know what Chris, Christian has been up to this evening. The front wheels are terrible, in my opinion. Okay. Well, the good news is I have a lot of vehicle sets, so if I have to, I can rearrange things a little bit. That's funny when you guys have built some of the sets I'm building. Uh, and those two silver, those last two silver slides. It's crazy, man, with the Marvel stuff. Every single set we've had either had something silver or something gold. It's really crazy. They didn't, okay, so they didn't put it anywhere. Oh, this is orange. Ooh, looks kind of red. I just watch it and rerun and skip over the dinner break. Yeah, that's what I would do, too. I've never really had a problem re-watching live streams. Sometimes it's kind of relaxing. The car itself is nice. Uh, let me go ahead and just grab the Dodge the Charger, 1970 uh, Dodge Charger. Where we can kind of compare these vehicles as we go. So this was a really great build. It's the rear end right there. The front. Looks incredible from the front. I remember building that, and I was like, dude, that's awesome. This set needs dusted. The old Swiffer. Pretty much everything is tiled here as well. Very smooth. It'll be interesting to compare size. This one has black wheels. This thing is all blacked out. So far, we're very close to the same size. The underbelly is literally identical. Right here. Identical. Is that retired yet? This right here, this Dodge Champs? No. I just got one the other day. Get a paint paintbrush for dusting. That's a very good idea. That's small enough that I can just cruise right along. You got that Dodge too. That's cool. Yeah. That's a great set there. Yeah, real game changer, I bet. Yeah, see, that's what you need to do, Aaron. You just need to go to the hospital on GTA 5. Get yourself a knife, a bottle, whatever you need, and just hit a fake person. Just don't do it in real life, please. Boom. Just punch her. While she's sitting on the 
on the bench talking on her phone and just punch her. <laughs> oh, it's been a while since I played GTA 5, I'll tell you. I used to parachute, used to jump, parachute, and try and, and try and get somebody on the fall. Like, <laughs> that game is ridiculous. I'm, I'm serious. Okay, so we'll attach that right there. Weird, but we have studs on side from that, and then we're going to do something similar with the clip here. Uh, and studs are going to connect as well. Okay, so that's secured. Looks like it might be longer. Yeah, this is going to be longer. The feds are coming run. Killed them all at the hospital. Yeah, you got to go. You got to go. You got to go. You got to go right now. Oh, weird with that one tile right there, that one by one tile back there. You should check out my YouTube friends, Lego City. We spent 50 hours on the bookshop mock. Yeah, um, I don't know how to tell you to link it to me the best way. Besides, if you follow me on social media, it would be very easy, but. Yeah, I've got a few days off this week, so I'll be able to catch up on some stuff. This is going to be a good week for me. I'm, not, I'm probably not going to start doing working on the firehouse very, very much this week because I'm probably going to work on that on live stream next week with you guys. So I would assume you would want to see some of that stuff. So I wish I could play around with those, but I know some of them are going to go into the set. Yeah, I mean, yeah, if it's if it's an easy find, I can I always have a pen and paper right beside me at my desk. Go ahead. I don't like this pen though. I like rollerball pins. Oh, okay. Oh from Canada, cool, yeah. Macro Yeah, I'll check that out. You said you helped him for a little while. Uh, we spent about fifty hours on the Lego, the bookshop mock. Did you, uh, Jonathan? How's it going? Welcome. What's going on this evening? Did you uh, basically alternate build the bookshop mock, or did you custom build a different bookshop? What's going on, you understand? Uh, it's a very similar car to that Dodge Challenger, really, or Dodge Charger. I knew it was going to be. I didn't really care, honestly. Uh, we give feedback on live streams as a group on the channel. Oops. I think these are probably supposed to go. Aha! See? Pay attention. It's an alt version of the bookshop set with a curved build now. Okay, I'm really excited to check that out. Yeah, that's probably really cool. There's not really a whole lot of good alt versions of the bookshelf. Oh, thank you. I'm glad it's oh, I'm glad that it's the back. I don't like when the sets don't have a windshield. I'm sorry. I don't know how you guys feel about that, but I cannot stand that. Yeah, I I Working on a couple of rebrickables myself. Obviously, I'm not gonna. I'm not working on them right now. 
I'm not at that skill level yet, but hopefully I will be. I think that would be a good idea to start maybe with that instead of, you know, because I don't have like a ton of pieces. So until I get my pieces right, it's like I can't really even try to make a modular by myself. When I am in a, whoa. <laughs> Bro, I still haven't gotten an email from Lego confirming my missing parts for the carrot house have been shipped. What? Build cars. That's how you would maybe try and learn. Did you need to email them again then if you're really worried about it? They probably don't have them. They probably don't even have another one of those sets. They seem to be running into a problem of running out of Lego. I've got a couple vehicles here. Yeah, we're going to work on rules. We are getting a bunch bunch more people. So um, let's see. That one I'm going to build. Ah, this one I'm pretty excited about, too. That's uh, 8 stud Ferrari. I think it has a lot of detail. It's going to be sweet, but. Yeah, you might as well just email them again, see what's going on. They take about a day and a half, two days to email me back, so I would assume it's about the same for you. To in-person school? Woo! That's awesome, man. That is really a fantastic thing. That's where you can actually learn and, you know, socialize and have a good time, a normal life. Yeah, this set here, I'm going to do a couple of on this. I need some red vehicles to add to yeah, there's kids on here, too, so. It's not good for the kids. Is that wheel just going? Yeah, that's awesome. Yeah, that's... It sucks for you guys that it's been a kind of a hard... Hard life, really, for a while. I'm sorry you guys had to go through that. I hope that things can clear up. And and everyone can go back to school. There you go. And my mom's a teacher, and they've been back and forth between. Uh, they've been back and forth between in person, half the people, one third the people. Some Indiana food, sure. You mean like a corn dog? You mean like a, a corn cob? You mean like mashed potatoes? You mean like hamburgers? What else do we eat? What else do we eat around here? A ribeye sandwich? Pulled pork? <laughs> uh... You, you want me to go to McDonald's now and pick it up, or? It's hot out here. I mean, it's only 75, but that's kind of hot. Yeah, I can, yeah. Yeah, that's interesting. You know, I was actually talking to my mother the other day about um, some of the stuff that she watches on YouTube and, you know, how to be more personable, basically, with YouTube. So uh, there's a video that I released today you guys should check out. It shows all the sets that I'm going to build this week. I, it's a vlog, and I went through and pulled out all the sets that I was going to build this week and kind of give you guys an overview, a brief overview before the week got started. Seems odd. 
But no, that's what they're going to do. What's up, Travis? Nerd break. Welcome. Yeah, what am I going to build next? Tomorrow, I'm going to be building the Carnage Helm. Yeah, check that video out today. See if you guys like that kind of uh, style of letting you guys know what's going on. But yeah, the Carnage Helm tomorrow. I'm not sure where to put it, but advertise maybe right here. I don't want to block Carnage himself. Looking for anything military? Me? What kind of stuff? Why are you trying to sell something? I'm not quite to the point of having the military base. I need the airport and I'll probably do the military base like kind of maybe with the the airport. I kind of I was having some soul searching the other day and I was thinking to myself how to make the Lego city a little bit more custom. And I was thinking to myself like, well, why not just make it kind of a little bit of a representation of where I'm from, you know? So maybe I'll do things like how, how it is around here. And I think that's pretty cool rivers and yeah, just kind of farms and things like that. The train's going to be sweet. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Okay, here come the wheels. I would assume it would be spokes in. I'm so pumped for the train. I just, the train might come with like the smaller road plates or the new road plates, the smaller road plates where it comes with a condensed Condensed city. Basically, I'll be able to condense my city. My city. Oh, I appreciate it, Aaron. Yeah, this is a pretty cool set here. I was glad to get some minifigs and a, a vehicle because you guys know that I'm a little light on vehicles. So, <coughs> not it's not really that bad. It's just okay. So why don't you like these these front wheels? So it rides like taller in the back, which is kind of interesting. Might throw off the shooter a little bit, huh? Because it's not going to go straight ahead. It's going to come down. It's like a construction wheel tire. Yeah, the tire itself. Yeah, it is. It is a construction wheel tire. They wanted to make it small. Yeah, they definitely could have thrown like some of these boys on there. Some racing tires. This one has a lot more friction on the roll because of the way. So check this out. Sorry to do like a comparison right here live, but they use the same piece as the axle right there. It's got cross on. It's a Technic pen, but it's got cross on one and Technic pen on the other. And you see how this has the cross facing out. So the Technic pen is inside. So it's less friction versus right here where it has the Technic pen on the outside and it actually creates more friction and you have less of a roll right there because this way the Technic pin is spinning inside. See, it's loose and spinning inside. And it seems to run a lot better when you do it like this, but it's cool to see both options. Looks like they're going to pin through. Oh, cause we're going to add fire elements onto the wheels. Okay. Looks like some 12s in the front. Yeah. What character is on top? That is Spider-Man Noir, which is an all-black Spider-Man who uses revolvers. And he is he's wearing like a leather jacket. He's got kind of an outlaw theme going on there. And he is from the Great Depression era. In the comic books, apparently, Stan Lee wanted to make Spider-Man a little bit depressed as well. And on the Lego sign, we have Carnage. He's crawling up the Lego sign. Probably to try and assassinate Spider-Man more. But I got to say, if he's got a revolver, good luck. Because all he has to do is look down and shoot that dude. Sticks out way too far in the front. Which, what does? 
It's looking sweet, man. It's like it. Sticks out way too far in the front. Yeah, stick the tire sticks out too far. Yeah, and then they add these on there too, so we even have more stuff. I think it's not supposed to look like maybe a realistic car. Maybe they're trying to exaggerate some of the elements of the build a little bit to characterize Marvel, a comic. You know what I mean? Just kept those parts for later use. Yeah, I might do the same thing as well. Oh, I don't even think I noticed Carnage. Yeah, here he is right here. And then we have Ghost Rider right here. And another Spider-Man. We got three Spider-Mans in one week. Isn't that crazy? But Spider-Man is kind of a, 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 what's a theme. It is Marvel, but it's a theme that LEGO has right now itself. You should put some big boy tires on that tang. These back ones are decent, but yeah, the front ones are a little bit smaller. It goes, look. Oh, cool. So it says you can pop these off of here, huh? Ah. Ah. Break it down, build it to break it. Here we go again. So these are going to be like exhaust coming out of here. We got side exhaust, exhaust pipes. Then we have also tailpipes, which is kind of weird. Let me just add them in here to see what's going on. It might be cool. That head for Ghost Rider looks sick. Yeah, I, I'm not sure exactly what series of the comics it comes from, but put 20s on the back. 20s. We're putting 34s on this thing. We're taking it through the freaking the field, bro. I'll pack. I put 36s on it. I think it will look better on a wheel swap. I need to do that. Yeah, it's... Sometimes you got to play around with their sets a little bit. It's not that big of a deal. It's It just allows a little bit of customization, honestly. But yeah, I think they wanted this to be kind of comical. So they, this vehicle here is not exactly the most realistic thing I've ever seen in my life. But I'm just going to mix and match these a little bit here. That size difference that they have. Put them on opposite sides. Not sure what this is here. It's like a, it goes on the, whoa, cool. It goes on the fist so you can, the Ghost Rider can punch with it, I would assume. Yeah, he's, yeah, he can hold these here. These are like the handcuffs that they make for Spider-Man. Well, I'll try. I'm trying. Those wheels would be like a 22-inch wheel in real life. <laughs> yeah. Uh, those are huge, aren't they? I put Speed Champion wheels on my Grand National. The wheels barely fit. It will not spin. Oh, yeah. Here's Ghost Rider with the punch. I'm sorry, that took a little while there, but. 36 is that big. That's what you put on Jeeps and trucks around here, buddy. So much paperwork. I kept trying something, and then my comment gets deleted. Why? I didn't delete your comment. Are you saying something bad? We don't see anything over here. Yeah, unless YouTube doesn't want you to say something that you're saying, I'm not exactly sure. We have the stud sh shooters on the front there. You can fire some fire at his enemies. Carnage, specifically. Because Carnage is uh, not a nice guy. I'm not putting this one on there. There's only one. Yeah, that's, those are too cheesy on the 
on the tires. Too cheesy for me. Too cheesy like John's Pizza. I had to put thinner tires on my 22s to not scrape the wheel wells at stock height back in 2006. <laughs> <laughs> that's funny I don't think they look horrible with the fire elements on there obviously they can be used for something else but then we'll get some more when we build the uh, blazer and taser but I think that it looks pretty cool it gives it that comical feel it really does I think they are good for the build because in my opinion they just they do give the set a little bit of a comical feel to it like it's not realistic. In comparison to the Dodge Charger, 1970 Dodge Charger size, we're looking at a whole stud longer. Actually, probably a stud and a half because we hang over because of the slide here. We're definitely a stud longer. Same stud, six studs wide. There's the front of the build right there. Close in comparison. Definitely close in comparison. Um, not sure why that's open there. This needs, I guarantee these one by twos. If not, they're going there because it needs them. The tail end right here. Very close. Very, very close. There should probably be some kind of a license plate right here or something. I'm not sure. It seems like it, it's meant to be there. I don't know if maybe it came off or what. And I'll check it out and see if that set comes with the, the... There they are right there. Those are cool. Cool vehicles, man. Great minifigs. Now we can be like crawling on the... I don't like this window. There's no need for it to only have one stud connection or two studs connection right there. It's could definitely be a one by four. See, that's just that's not that's not exactly good. Here he comes. Oh yeah, you're done for, buddy. Buddy, carnage on that roof, dude. Then in comes Spider-Man to try and save the day. Web slinging and all. You know what I mean. Definitely can set it up. Spider-Man Noir. Who knows what we'll need. All right, back to work. Have a good night, everyone. Steven, we got to get a brig or even a galleon out. If Okay, no, that, that's actually a good idea. I hope you're still here and heard me. Yes, please text me or something. If you don't have my number, we need to link that up. Burn rubber, do some donuts. You know what I mean? Get them all hot. And then bust it, dude. This would be a really nice uh, drag race right here, wouldn't it, huh? That'd be pretty sweet. Finish this paperwork on a 1986 Cutlass. I had to put thinner tires of real life. Yeah, 1986 Cutlass. <laughs> oh, yeah, you hit one bump to pop the tire. No license plates from the cars from Gary. How do you know about Gary, dude? Is he from Indy? Oh, if we had a supercharger? Yeah, even even a turbo would be fun. Both would be phenomenal, but I'd be like, <laughs> I mean, right now. <laughs> Getting it. These are nice whips, I'm telling you. That's going to be cool to have riding around the city. I'm not going to lie. I might have gotten a set for the minifigs, but I'm glad to have the vehicle. I'm from Oregon. How do I know about Gary? Yes. How do you know about Gary? Gary, Indiana? That is what you're talking about, right? More of those clear pieces, those are really good. I got to go, we'll be busy tomorrow night, so I won't be around. Oh, you're gonna miss the carnage head. No problem, no problem, John. Thanks for stopping by, as always. Have a good night.
They see me riding dirty. Gotta see me riding dirty. Gotta see me riding dirty. Gotta see me riding dirty. Makes me think of the Weird Al, Weird Al song, White and Nerdy. I feel like Spider-Man Noir needs to drive like maybe this one. But my comic keeps getting removed and it ain't nothing bad. That's weird because I'm not removing it and you're obviously posting other comments. Maybe try to use synonyms. Yeah, I need some Spider-Man web, dude. I'm telling you. This guy can only see. He can't even fly through my city. It's sad. I like the Spider-Man with the dual mold. Those are really nice. We need to connect some of these. I've got some pieces we can, some trans orange. We can connect these and have like a fire. Stop three most dangerous city in USA. Flint, Gary, and... Are you serious? How could it possibly be more dangerous than Chicago? Yeah, you didn't see Murphy today. Yeah, we don't drive through Gary, dude. Especially with my color skin. I just steer clear there, dude. I'm good. I don't need to go there. What's up, RJ? Welcome to the end of the stream, my friend. We just hit one hour. Ten likes. You guys are lit. Thank you. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. 11 likes. Holy cow. It changed right before my eyes. Once I finish in the spot. Try Town's not even top 10. Pfft. They got like 40 murders a day or a week in there. Yeah, I, I don't go to Gary. I'm, I'm good. There's no point in me going to Gary. The rest of Indiana is just fine without Gary. Chicago can have it. They can keep it, claim it, own it, don't care. Yeah, true. Oh, just like percentage-wise, you mean? That's okay. Yeah, I mean, nobody's really going to know all that cosmetic stuff unless, yeah, you know, it's just you, so. RJ. <laughs> GLD. Oh. Yes, Aaron. My happiness at having this. I'm literally so happy to have this. I'm so happy. I am really so happy to have this. They did a really good job with the Carnage, Carnage minifig also. Yeah, I've seen that these are sticker pieces on his, his home, but I really don't care. This is a beautiful set, dude. And my first, like, stand collector piece, so I'm very excited for that. I gotta go eat, man. I'm really starving. Oh, I bet, dude. 500? Yeah, 546 pieces. I'll just hug it. I love it. It's gonna do the autofocus now that I move really fast and then make the clicky click sounds. 546. 546. Like I said, 76199. 546 pieces. Fantastic set. I cannot wait for. I'll do Iron Man. I'll get the Venom. I'll probably start getting some of these Lego Star Wars ones, especially on May the 4th. I'm going to try and pick some of the ones that I really, really want. Hopefully, they don't go out of stock. So if you guys are interested in them, do not buy them because I plan on buying one. I don't care. If you get it before me, it's, it is what it is. Okay, bye. Buy yourself, though. All right, guys, we got seven people in here, but yeah, I got to go eat. I will be back for the Carnage Home tomorrow. It'll be a lot longer stream. I'm not working tomorrow. That I know. As long as none of my routes go down, I will be here. So I got some stuff to work on in the Lego City tomorrow. And then uh, I'll be doing doing the Carnage set tomorrow. I might stream twice. I'm not sure. 
Yeah, I don't know, Joe, dude. That's fried. Just hit me up on Instagram, man. Tell me, tell me on Instagram. Send me a DM on Instagram of what you were gonna say, because that just seems weird. Like you can type these other stuff, but you can't type that. That's weird. Bye, big block. Have a good night. Thank you for stopping by. I appreciate you guys. Twelve likes. You guys are crazy. You guys are chatting. You guys are liking. You guys are crazy. I appreciate that. If you want to see what we're going to do for the rest of the week, go ahead and watch the video from today. Oh, yeah. Thank you. I'm so excited for that. I can't wait to do that either. Yep. And if you like that blog style video, please let me know in the comments so I can continue doing something. There's that gold, gold ink it right there. I can continue doing content like that. If you don't like content, please leave a comment saying that you don't like that content. If you do like that content, please leave a comment saying you do like that content. All right, guys, I'm out. Peace. I will see you tomorrow. I'll be back with a fantastic set. I'm going to go run around my city for a while and call some ramp, some some rampage, do some rampage with uh, Carnage and Ghost Rider here. You too, Aaron. Stay up tonight, my friend. Everything's good. You got you got it in the bag. Speaking of bag, focus on your bag. Give you something to pay attention to. All right, I'm out. Peace. Have a good night, everyone.